cheeky cheeky modulus question. Find the values of x such that this inequality uh, is the situation. Now, any question to a modulus solving, you should be drawing a sketch. Modulus functions have a V shape. A modulus around it means that it's going to have a, well, I just said that, a V shape. Now, the way you basically draw these super quick is you just make this equal zero. That tells you where the vertex is. That's same as completing the square with quadratics. What's inside the bracket basically tells you the x value of where it uh, has the turning point, right? Now, when you make that equal zero, you get minus three over two. Then you just draw a V shape. Okay. This part of the line is obviously 2x plus 3 because it's a positive gradient. This part has a negative gradient, so it's the negative of this. The modulus basically took all the negative parts of the line and reflected it up. So this would be y is minus 2x minus 3. It's the negative of all of that. This crosses the y-axis at 3, yeah, because it's a plus 3. And then 5 is over here. So what we need to do first is find the x values of where these two graphs meet. So the first one, we're just going to say 5 equals minus 2x minus 3. This one is when 5 equals 2x plus 3. Uh, bring that here, minus the 5, so we get 2x is the positive 5 on the other side is minus 8. x is minus 4. Here we're going to get 2x is 2, x is 1. It wants to know, when is the V below 5? Here's my V. Where do you see it being below 5? Above, 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 equal, below, 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 equal, above. So it's this part here, is when the V is below the line. Those are these X values between minus 4 and 1 and it can't equal because of the inequality. Nice. 